Welcome back to the channel. You know the vibe. Subscribe, man. This is your boy, Maul, man. Welcome, man. Welcome to the house tour that I promised somebody in the comments months ago, bro. <laughs> like, literally months ago. But look, we're finally here. Morgan, she hooked the house up. Fantastically, bro. I know you see the you see the bling, don't you? You see the vibes. You know the vibes right there. And look, man. Today, first off, I want you to take a peek of that background. And just look at it every day. It's a bit cloudy today, but whatever, bro. But I'm about to ring the doorbell. And Morgan's about to give us a lovely house tour of everything that she worked hard to accomplish, man. In like two seconds, I'm going to show you the outside of the house. So, ring the doorbell. She'll buzz me in. And we'll go from there. I'm like she opened the main gate. We we going in the crib now, man. This is the outside of the crib, man, right here. Walking up, no, nice large yard. Feel me? Dalmatian in the back, ain't I ain't mine. It's a nice yard, man. And lovely Morgan, man. Hey guys, welcome to our lovely home. Okay, so I guess you're gonna break down. We're gonna take you through, um, yeah, what we're working with here, what we've been putting together, what I've been working on the last what two weeks, I would say. Um, so yeah, so let's start. First off, Peach, I know y'all saw those front doors, which I love to death. The glass and the lights that automatically comes through. Um, but yeah, so we have a little calendar over there with our schedule and things that we don't want to forget. Um, TV, a very similar layout to our home back in Raleigh in a sense, well, as far as the living room area goes. Um, a house is not a home, so we've added a lot of photos of our friends and our family and this lovely, amazing painting that I still love that Maul got me um, for my birthday one day, I believe. So it makes my heart smile. Uh, we're going to get to that side of the house later. Um, this is our game area, so whenever we have people over, you know, we got Jenga, karaoke, boggle, all the things, hearing things, what Maul used to propose to me um, when we got engaged. And we keep our bicycle helmets here. That way we can just grab them and go, even though our bike's are in the garage. So, we're going to start with our guest bedroom. Um, First things first, what I absolutely love, I don't know if you all can see it, just when the light comes in, the fact that all, almost all of our windows in our house just open up. Like, forget French doors, I'm totally here for French windows all day long. You have mosquito screens to keep the critters out. Um, but yeah, so whenever we have people come over, this is where you will be at. Obviously, we'll use it for storage as well. The majority of these closets over here um, is filled with, I don't know, just my stuff. I'm finally showing it. You know, I just, I got a couple things in here. Not too much, not too little. Just enough, but I'm in Italy. So I do plan on adding more, why not? All right, but again, it's only one. Um, yeah, and then of course just photos and it's, there's a nice size room. Hey, All these rooms. Hey, hold on amazing. real quick, bro, I mean to uh, interrupt your tour. What you mean, what you mean you plan on adding more? What? Well, you know, you, whenever you go to new places, it's important to add things oh, to open, your... Open that one, too? What's this? What's, what's the drip looking like? You know, you hair like care, yeah. self-care, you know, uh, pants, tops. I'm here to help you save your money, but I feel it. But I'm here to help you spend yours. Thanks, babe. See? That was yours. It's not my mind. That's all my stuff real quick. Okay, drippy. She ain't spending my money. I don't know what you talking about. But my fault. Continue, babe. I ain't know what your closet look like. I got nervous. I won't share. <laughs> All right. So our main bedroom. It is still a work in progress, but it is getting there. I'm here for it. Um, yeah, mostly this is my dresser. We have separate dressers. It is what it is. Uh, we have, yeah, separate dressers, separate closets. Um, you know, my little go-to station for things that I need in my becoming journal. Shout out to Michelle Obama. She's a real one. All right. Um, same as I was saying before, right? These lovely windows that just open up. They make my heart smile. Um, we have our blue and, I don't know, tannish <laughs> um, idea going on. These lovely anchor pillows that my mom had got us back in the day. Um, so everything is kind of going to use. And again, like I said, large space, 
his dresser, a little mirror, you know, check yourself with all this natural light, necessary. All right, and then just a couple of my shoes, you know, put in the corner. The rest, once again, in storage. Have to get rid of some of these soon too, so I can do what? Buy some more. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. Oh, you need to ooh, stop saying that. Hurt my feelings. Um, so this is our main bathroom that we're using. Um, it's a decent sized space. Lovely little shower curtain, a regular toilet, and a, I don't know what these are called. Boudet. Boudet. Yeah, you can get your butt with. A booty? Booty? Or spraying your butt hole. Right. I don't, you know, Ma uses it. I don't, so. I don't, I don't, I don't use it. I'm just telling you what I do. Don't allow me to. Okay. Y'all know what's up. Um, so yeah, so again, we just had this look of it, it becoming and creating homey. I wish I could show I had the toilets flush here, but that's for a different story. Cause it's just, it's weird. It's different. I don't know. But I mean, I guess, okay, look, we can do it. So instead of like the normal handles like you have, you actually like spin it. And then you wait for the water to like, I don't know, disintegrate the tissue and get all your business out. And then you spin it back. Again, it's just something new, but hey, it is what it is. Um, so yeah, let's keep it moving. Uh, I created this little faux hidden curtain thing for storage. So we have, um, very. it's very organized back there, but there's no need in opening it up. But you know, our winter clothes at this point is starting to warm up. I think yesterday was like 75. So there's no point in having all that stuff out because we're already almost out of space. Um, so all that stuff is back there. And it's just helpful. And yeah, they still have easy access to whatever it is we need. All right, back up here, more of mall shoes. These lovely radi radiators, all right, heaters that are found in every single room. And another window. Cost me money, bro. All right. all right, so I guess we can start with this lovely area right here. This is mall all day, all night. All right, all of his favorite things, except for me are located right here on this end of our dining table. All right, we have his TV, his PS4. All right, a lovely Sprite. If you want sponsors, just, just let me know. We're here, Sprite. Okay, <laughs> a MacBook. All right, um, his podcasting right for his podcast, Worse Than the Internet, all right. Um, so this is his workstation. This is where he does what he got to do, his YouTube videos, the podcast, all the things. All right, and we're just here to support. I'm usually on the couch with a glass of wine, but I'm still nearby whenever he needs me. Um, we created this. Not only is it a lovely background for when he is doing his videos, but it's our like little go-to area. All right, it's calm, it's relaxing. I love rose gold. This thing, wine for normal people. Um, we have some wine down there, speakers, coasters. The Adventure Challenge, which is a couple like date night book. All right, so we have all the things there that just keep us leveled and keep us grounded in where we are. All right, um, again, dining table. That door out there takes you straight to the garage and then out there as well. We're not gonna do that today. We're just not doing it. Um, there's a set of stairs and that takes you to, I guess, a basement that's about half, if not more than the size of our house. So it's quite large. But I will say one thing I do think is super cool is all these little skeleton keys. The bathrooms have them. Um, you have to have the key to get in and out. The garage door has them. So it's lit. What, 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 what is this? Don't look. Pretty sure a lot of this stuff is in here. Again, like I said, we're still getting things put together and put away and organizing. Therefore, there's lots of boxes. And reduce, reuse, recycle, guys. It's recycling is key. All right, so therefore, each box we've broken down and each piece of wood will be disconnected. I don't know how you, what you do with that, but they will be taken to the appropriate disposal locations. All right, come with me. We're still walking. All right, and welcome to where I spend the majority of my time in this home, which is the kitchen. If you know me, you know that I try to cook for my husband every single day. So it's essential that we have all of the proper utensils and things are clean and they are put. We're gonna be in the house before you gotta tell the truth. You can't I'm telling the truth. Don't be love. I cooked yesterday. It's just your love. But I cooked yesterday. I'm gonna cut this out. Don't. Hey. Are you ready? Go ahead. So again, um, 
I'll just leave that there from where I had left off. So like I was saying, so we have things like our microwave, um, the air fryer, right, which we made chicken wings with yesterday. All right, cure it, because I'm a coffee girl and I need it. The, oh, one thing to mention though, right, is again, we're in Italy, so everything has Italian plugs. So it's a mixture of buying these transformers, which then turn the, you know, allow us to have Italian outlets and American outlets and having those things in. And we almost, shoot, we thought we messed up the microwave and the air fryer yesterday. We plugged them both in at the same time and something short circuited. Y'all, I thought it was the air fryer. I was about to cry. But everything's good. Everything's fine. We're making it through. Um, so, yeah, so we got some artwork, our matching aprons on the side here, which I absolutely love. We have Jamal's, all right, head chef, the Moore residence, all right, and then mine, Miss Moore. So we get to wear that when we are cooking and getting our um, groove on in the kitchen. All right, and then what I am super excited about is all of this cabinet space. And we literally have all the things, all the space, everything fits. There's under cabinets down here. And then even on the kitchen island, we have even more space and drawers and all the things. Ma will be low-key over it just because I reorganized and moved everything. I know you can't really find it sometimes, but hey, it's fine. We're not in a rush. Everything's good to go. Say the windows that open. All right. Looks like our neighbors are getting together for a little food. All right. So we're now entering this part of the house that we don't really come to. You know, we have a little more space than we need. But it's fine. But we'll still show it to y'all. But please don't have high expectations. Because ain't nothing in here. All right. This is technically a third bedroom in my mind. It was going to be an office. But the Wi-Fi back here, it ain't it. So it's kind of just another storage space. Printers. Food time. They haven't put together yet. Because we have enough couch space out there. All right. And then back here is just another bathroom that we definitely don't want in. I don't think I've ever been in here. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a shower curtain. Yeah, that tells y'all that I'll be in there. Did you want me to turn that light on? No? All right. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it grooving. Let's get out of here. Bow. But what about the what about the outside? What does the, what the whole house look like outside? Oh, the outside. Okay, so I guess y'all got to see the very front of the house. So definitely here for that part. We can do a quick little walk around. Um, yeah, get our steps in. So, here we go. All right, so behind me are, I think these are duplexes. So somebody lives on the left one, and somebody else lives on the right one. Um, and then we're surrounded by, I guess really all duplexes are townhouses, as we usually call them in the state. Um, there's a little sidewalk that takes us everywhere around this house. So it makes it really easy to kind of, you know, just walk around. I've never really been back here, other than we have the wall one day after walking once, but. That part's not included. So you can see, you must be able to see into the rooms, which is good to know if people can see me or not, which now I know the answer is yes. So yeah, right here, I feel like Morgan ran out of stuff to say, so enjoy this speedy through while we go through the house. I want to love you, pretty young thing. Photo vocals are terrible, bro. What in the world am I talking about? Child to the neighbors, child to the neighbors. All right, let's get back to the tour. Let's get back to the tour. Yeah, and that brings us right back to the front of the house. And my man's cute little car. I know y'all love it. I picked it out myself online. And I picked out the house. I'm good at picking things out. But I hope that y'all enjoyed our house tour today. Um, if y'all have questions about anything, what it was like picking it, what our town is like, uh, yeah, any struggles that we do find with the house or even some of our favorite parts, we've already said, which a lot of it is just dealing with these windows and the lighting and the airiness of it all. Um, just let us know. Hit us up. Tell us what's up. And with that, you know the vibe. Subscribe. It's your girl Morgan. Mall's behind the camera. And <laughs> we out.